So Hound being the odd one out, playing the wrong color Yoshi. <laughs> yep, the blue Yoshi himself. And I'm not sure what we're up. Here we go. All right. <laughs> so we're jumping into game one on Battlefield. All right. Well, not Smashville for once. That's good. That's always nice to see every now and then. I know. Fantastic. Don't start on Smashville. So this matchup is something that is totally different from its Brawl counterpart. Um, Yoshi actually has a good advantage um, in this match. Um, Yoshi's a pretty heavy character. Meta Knight likes to kill off the top with up air, up air, up air, up B. Um, but Yoshi, being one of the heavier characters in the game, has the survivability factor. Hey, what's up? Uh, How's it going? Pretty good, pretty good. I'm Nick, or Nitch. Uh, get into the match here. D2DA. Uh, do you know anything about either of these players? Uh, so Hound is a regular Yoshi. He doesn't really come... <laughs> he doesn't really come here often, and D2DA is um, a pretty good Mennonite player. He's here um, every once in a while. He plays a great Mennonite. And so what we're seeing here is D2DA having um, a pretty slight deficit. Make that a pretty large deficit. Um, we have Hound playing phenomenally, yeah, yeah, as, as he as has been for quite some time. Taking some risks, maybe a little bit unnecessary. Yeah, oof, yeah. It's scary. Whenever, whenever Meta Knight does something, he can always just combo. And really, any multi-hit move is a little bit scary because it combos into whatever he wants to. Mm -hmm. That's forward smash, very safe. It's worth throwing out on the edge. Yeah, if he lands one forward smash, it's over at this percent. Really good spot dodge. What's he gonna do? Oh, oh. tornado no, doing massive damage. Done, and is that gonna do it? No. Again, like I said, Yoshi has that survivability factor. He's gonna mm -hmm. live for a little while. Meanwhile, he's almost at max rage, and not anymore. Like I said, forward smash. Every once in a while, throw out the forward smash. You might as well. Game, you know? Oof, and game. there we go. Evens it up. Brings it right back. So what's the plan now? Let's see. So, okay, that was a mistake. Oh, oh is that it? Yep, oh, that's it. Oh, that's... We take those. Classic but... Yoshi mistake. Egged himself off the stage. Not what you want to be doing. Um, happens to the best of us. He did play really well, though. So as long as he plays the next match exactly like that, um, but keeps the execution errors down to a minimum, um, we're going to be seeing a much different match game two. Let's see how it pans out. So we're going to Final Destination. Um, Yoshi is really good on Final Destination. Mm -hmm. I personally don't really see why. Um, not fantastic on it myself. Uh, um, yeah, the, the lack of platforms for, for him obviously makes it a little harder for him to get what it he's does. about to do right now. Um, I think that the uh, the thinking here is that Meta Knight isn't going to be able to start up airing him from a platform, exactly. so he's going to be able to survive longer, which was one of the problems in game one. Yeah, no sharking. But, uh, yeah, I mean, he has, what, four jumps? So, I mean, it's still... Right, exactly. It's still pretty easy for him to... It's not like a... It's still going to be pretty jump. difficult. Um... But the stage advantage is pretty good. Mm -hmm. um, right now, ooh, okay. No fear. <laughs> we have Hound with a pretty big deficit, but that's okay. Yoshi is uh, really good at dealing damage. Yeah, I mean... Or you see Hound come in with some good combos here. Yeah, good good DI by D2DA. And just like that, we evened it up. Anything, anything in this percent can lead into a kill. Wow. Walk forward slowly and forward smash. Please, no memes in this shot. <laughs> there it is. Wow, in the lead. Good, Definitely a good counter pick for this stage. Really, really nice. Yeah, this is exactly what's, what happened um, earlier. Oh, there we go. They didn't do Omega. The blinding light. <laughs> so everything going on now is going to be extra credit. Yeah. He's got a whole lot of it at that, at that, at that point. I wonder why I didn't go for the smash there. Playing really safe right now. Um, I guess he has there, no reason there's to. really no reason to right now, yeah. Okay, that's totally fine. Yeah. Plenty of extra credit right now. TTDA really has lead. a bit of a hill to climb. Yeah, I mean, he's got rage, but how much does that help him, Meta Knight? Um, it will help him eventually, but he's going to need to build some damage first. Which he's oh, currently that, doing. That could have been it. That could have been it. That's the 
The constant fear of Meta Knight. Is this it? Ooh. Wow, and that did it at That's it? less than 50%. I feel kind of bad, actually. I don't. That's how the game is played, my man. Uh, okay, well, we have D2DA taking that overhound. Good job, D2DA. We don't see a lot of Mennonites here. It's like Seabrook and, and D2DA. Stream, DJ yeah, Seabrook, of course, is known for his Mennonite and has been for years. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so you still in the bracket, my man? I lost round one to a Donkey Kong. What was his a little, name? A little disappointed. Oh, cool. We're going to have Zaltus and DJ Jack. Oh, this will be a great match. Please. <laughs> Whoops. DJ Jack going by DJ Popo right now because he's a funny guy What's like happening? that. My co-commentator having trouble with the typing matchup. Listen, man. Listen. 